Hi, I'm Corey with Signal Hound, and uh, we're gonna do a quick demo today showing how we're gonna use an SA44 to analyze a signal we've got coming in from our VSG25A vector signal generator. And again, we're gonna be using Spike software running on a PC, and we're gonna be analyzing the signal with the SA44B 4.4 gigahertz analyzer. So let me dive over to that screen and take a look and see what I'm doing. So right now we've got the VSG generated signal at 315 megahertz. And I know that's where it's at. So I'm gonna come up here and spike. I'm gonna set the center frequency, my SA44B to 315 <coughs> megs. And then what we're gonna do is you can come over and we're gonna adjust the span and you can use these up and down toggles to change the span. What we're looking at with our SA44B um, you can type in the values manually, uh, which I'm going to do. And right here we can see our signal of interest coming in from the VSG. Then you can use these controls to kind of get down a little closer if you want. So we'll go down to 20 kilohertz. <clears throat> and then depending on the application, we've got these controls here. Uh, in the amplitude panel, we can change our reference level <clears throat> of the device sit here at uh, 40 dB, minus 40 dB, uh, and then let's see, we can show you the markers over here in the markers panel. Uh, we've got a variety of controls that we can use here. If we're just going to drop one on the screen, we can throw one on our peak, uh, which shows up here, and then we've got the information for that marker up here with the details. And you can actually use your mouse and move the marker around and watch those details change. Uh, and then if you ever want to come back here to your peak, you can click there. If there's a variety, you can just hit your peak search and they'll send you right back uh, to the highest one visible in the spectrogram. So that's it. Just a quick demo for today uh, on how to use your SA44 to look at a signal of interest um, in Spike Spectrum Analyzer software.